In Banu, critical stakeholders from the Kwande Intermediate Area have dissociated themselves from the decision of the former Chief of Staff to the Benue State Governor, Tawase Obunde, to leave the PDP for the APC. The former Chief of Staff was one among many governorship aspirants on the platform of the PDP from Kwande who lost out due to the zoning arrangement which favoured a Vandega local government area. My work, Quanto has details and will return with business news after this. On the 26th of April, the former Chief of Staff to Governor Samuel Otom joined the All Progressive Congress. He had earlier resigned to vie for the gubernatorial position come 2023. This was believed to be as a result of him not being favored to be the consensus candidate of the People's Democratic Party, under which he chose to pursue his ambition. Now, the leaders from Kwande Intermediate Area have come to pay Governor Tom a solidarity visit at the government house in Makodi. They claim to remain members of the People's Democratic Party. They said the decision of the party to zone the governorship seat out of Kwande was fair and transparent, and the people in the area remain committed to the decision. What we are saying is that the campaign there was has the camps we are not aware, we are not in support of that. In the movement, we don't know anybody behind him until we research before we know whether someone is behind him. We, the PDP, in Kwande, in Kwande land, in Kwande nation, we disassociate ourselves from the actions of the former chief of staff. He's minding his business and we are minding our own business. When we are at home, we live like brothers. But when it comes to politics, we, have, we, are, we mind our business and he will mind his. Responding, Governor Samuel Otom thanked the Kwande stakeholders for standing with the decision of the party, but expressed displeasure over the decision of some of the aspirants who actively participated, but later turned back to discredit it. The present chief of staff, who spoke on his behalf, to the press said such people are not worthy to be trusted with leadership. His people have come to disassociate themselves from his uh, actions and to openly condemn his action. Because having worked with the governor for over seven years, or about seven years, and having been the governor's ally for many years, nearly two decades, if they have issues, they would have resolved those issues within them. Two of the governorship aspirants, Paul Ugwa and Adik Bogbase, in their separate comments said they have no problem with the decision of the party and have resolved to work with Titus Uba to win the election. Mayowa Okwato, TVC News, Makodi.